Stand by, 1400 meters. And away they go. Not a bad beginning, with the exception of Ravishing Lily, who just got taken up for a striders near the back end early on. Ida Fiesta and the Pink Silks, one of the first to respond. De Moyes right there, and Moss Girl prominent in third. Yells in fourth position. Floral Secret fifth. She's a Matador, slots into that sixth position. Then comes Fairy Fox behind these runners, catching Zeds. And Ravishing Lily is the trailer and racing seven lengths off an even tempo. Amoy at the 900 meter peg by a neck but taken on by Floral Secret who can wait no more and Floral Secret now in the orange silks now moves on by one length. Relegating Amoy second, Eda Fiesta's got a perfect run through in third. Then comes Moss Girl who's in a corner in fourth position, yells a length away. Then comes She's a Matador sitting quietly towards the inside, got those pink and black silks with about six lengths to trace down. Reminders for Fairy Fox, Ravishing Lily's going to have to come extreme outside and got her eight, nine lengths to trace down. Floral Secret says, catch me if you can at the 300 metre marker. Eda Fiesta in the pink silks, the first one to apply pressure. Moss Girl gets going in the white silks towards the inside. Yell, she's a matador. Eda Fiesta now throws down a big looking challenge now. And Eda Fiesta hit the front over the last 100 metres. Eda Fiesta's going on from Floral Secret. She's a matador staying on for third. Eda Fiesta too good though. Floral Secret second, she's a matador. Then came Yell. Moss girl behind these and Ravishing Lily ran downfield. Well, that's when the canter pass comes into effect. Number three, Ida Fiesta. She was the pick on the way down to the start. She went down floating. A couple of the other runners didn't go down all that well. A couple of the fancied runners not really stretching out. But number three, Ida Fiesta, the daughter of Var, came through with 300 meters to go. Floral Secret looked to pinch a break on them. Stays on for second. But Ida Fiesta, she threw down a good-looking challenge at the 300. She's a matador, yell, and then came Moss Girl further back in the running. A moi ravishing lily. 300 ago, and Eda Fiesta moved up confidently, takes on Floral Secret, and then just for a strider to the rider now, just asked the pond for a little bit extra to make sure she goes right through with the effort promised at the 300. Switches the sabre from right to left. Eda Fiesta continues just to drift around towards the center outside of the course, but too good for this lot. Floral Secret, she's a matador, yell back to the studio. The bright pink silks of... Eda Fiesta, number three for Greg and Karen Anthony. Stuart Randolph with the daughter of Var has come through to break the maiden. Number three on the card. Let's have a chat with uh, Karen first, who's having a lovely weekend, just considering the string of horses she's got. She opened up the weekend with Des Roches, and if you ask Karen, she knows this family well. You train the damn Allergette, I can still uh, remember her. She won many, many races for you, Karen. Uh, yes, Dees, when we saw this little one at the sales, we just had to take her home. She wasn't cheap uh, as a first foal, and she was very little. She's only just started to grow up now, mm. but her mom was absolutely brilliant. She won us eight races and very genuine. So I'm quite sure this little one's going to go on because she's like her mom. She's a very genuine little filly. We just haven't been able to get the draws. You can see constantly we've been drawn, in fact, even to day nine out of nine and we've had to just take our chances and run. I would like to say obviously thank you very much to Sukraj Racing. Uh, they support our yard and um, uh, thank you for all that support to Greg, to Jason, to all our grooms at home that do all the work. Thank you very much to Peter, our boss boy. It's an all-round effort. I must touch on your relationship with owners because you have a special one at the Sukraj. I know the kids and all the boys, they're frequently visiting your yard. They love the horses and it's a nice relationship that you build up with the family. Uh, yes, Jesus. They've got wonderful kids and they're, they're a great family. They, they share they give, they are really first class. Um, I'd also just like to say thank you to Stuart. 
Uh, what a lovely ride, and, and thank you for riding this filly today. The stables look good thank now. You. The stables look in good, Karen. We'll be following you. Well played. We're turning now. Thank well, you. Well done. Well done. Let's get Stuart Randolph in. And Stu, we, we don't want to take the limelight away from the Sukrajas in this filly, but you know, I watched the replay of the Phillies Guineas. There were a lot of hard luck stories, and uh, you were involved in the scrum as well. Yeah, I think mine's at the top of that list. <laughs> so, 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 so. Yeah, a very painful thing to see um, had to happen, and also yeah, it's a yeah, bit of bait, pill to swallow, as you say. You know, from that draw is always a killer, and to just have that interference on top of it is, is yeah, for a top filly like that is not nice. How did she pull up? Did you speak to Duncan? I believe she pulled up okay, thank goodness. So, yeah, just let's cross that bridge and move on for our next target. Well, we're certainly not going to write off after that performance. Now, coming back to this filly, you got to know her a bit, and as Karen mentioned, small in size but big in heart. Absolutely. Uh, no, all credit to, to Karen and team. Um, oh, prepared her beautifully today. She went down a treat, so we actually went down the other way just to keep her calm. Uh, the gates opened up, she came out like a rocket, and yeah, she just kept improving from there. So, well done to her and her team. Looked like the right type of field and a decent pace suited you? Absolutely, yeah. Uh, as I say, consistency rewarded. She finally got there. Um, like you say, right type of field. And also, yeah, the pace was on, which was nice. So I could sit up, you know, just there about, and not too much to make up. Also, for an effort, and she quickened up nicely. Anything else later on, Stu? We've got three races left. Yeah, I've got one more run in the last. Uh, lucky, hopefully, it's a lucky last for me. So. Not, not guilty or guilty or something? Guilty as charged, I think. Guilty <laughs> as charged, guilty as charged. It looks a three-horse race between one, two and Mowing's horse. Yeah, absolutely. You know, uh, there are others. It is open, so yeah, we, we've got the draw on our side. Uh, you know, Mouse is still learning to race. He's, he's a bit erratic. Sometimes he pulls, sometimes he relaxes. So hopefully we catch him in a, in a good right, uh, frame of mind, I should say, and things go well. You look good in pink, Stu. I think so. <laughs> <laughs> well done. Uh, well done to the Sukraj star. Thank you. Lovely. Let's get Santos Sukraj and a young gentleman, Avi, in. Firstly, your relationship with uh, Greg and Karen, I, I touched on it. You guys have become very good family friends. Yeah, very close these, and uh, we trust them, the honest trainers. You know? Same thing we want honesty in this game. You know, once you scale us one time, you can't scale the second time, you order the game. So, with them, it's fine. We're enjoying our racing with them. And coming to this horse, uh, we always cracked a bad draw, and three was a bad draw too. So as we jumped the horse and came off the draw, Arika all over us. It's a very good horse, you know. Reminds me of the family, small in size, big in heart. 100%. LJ won 10 races, the mother, yes. and Bava. So that's a party, boss. I know that upstairs you were lurking around the bookmakers. Uh, 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 you know, we got three bookmakers upstairs on the, on the first floor of the grandstand, and you, you were lurking around all three of them. Uh, I, I think Avi gave them a good hiding, so we just need one more to come from Ilanga, then they got to start cashing up. Well done, young Avi. Uh, thanks, Uncle Deez, and this win is for my brother Avi. I know he got the lock big time. This win for him. Well done, enjoy it. Thanks. Lovely. Well done to the Sukrajas, a more passionate family you won't find around in racing. They are. Love their horses, love their racing, love their punting, and they're going to collect you with number three here at the Fiesta. Three, four, one, and seven. That's your provisional results, race number five.